Hello there you guys! Hopefully audio and all that is good. This intro is kind of loud. <laughs> Let's see, Forest Video Gamer, I know you guys are in here. It's Suki and Arcadis! Arcadis, you're like earlier today. <laughs> I'm gonna use the Pro Controller. We're gonna play on this save file. How's everyone doing today? I'm blue? What? Why am I blue? What? <laughs> What's going on? Did you like my homework banter? I did the video gamer. It very much reminded me of myself. <laughs> Oh, the layout! <laughs> oh, yeah. I like the picture behind it. I'll show you guys when we're not in a cutscene. <laughs> Forgive me for not reading today. My throat is completely shot. 
The camera's a bit brighter than usual. Yeah, I've been tinkering with the um, colors and lights and settings. <laughs> Have I mentioned how much I love Wind Waker's soundtrack? It's gorgeous. <laughs> Still doing homework and craving chocolate? You should have been in the US or in Canada. We have Halloween. <laughs> Lots of chocolate. Day 23. Ugh. <laughs> been playing Animal Crossing instead of doing anything you were meant to be doing. That was me earlier. <laughs> I was enjoying the, uh, the daily quests a bit too much. We have to swap platforms? No worries. Actually, today, you guys, I used my amiibo card reader thing for, like, the second time ever. Because <laughs> I wanted to see what happens when you uh, tap on Into New Leaf. 15 hours this weekend on Animal Crossing alone. Arcadis, I think you're not alone, don't worry. <laughs> oh! The J Plays is here. I'll say hi to him when he's actually in here properly. <laughs> Lies, he said he wouldn't. I know, right? <laughs> you can be the nice one and I'll be the cynical one. Hello there, Jay Plays. How are you doing? Max, hello! <clears throat> My voice is cutting out, I'm sorry. How are you doing today? Nothing like a good voice crack, eh? <laughs> Taking a break on your school project? What's your school project about? <clears throat> if I may ask. I heard the Canadian A. <laughs> Day 52 point or 53.2, what is life? <laughs> Outset Island, gosh. Like, this game really didn't need a remake, but it is so good. Is my audio not playing properly? Hi! Audio, why? I'll have to fix it in a second. It's a very curious introduction for a Zelda game. It's I believe, kind of showing somewhat the events of uh, Ocarina of Time. One of them is the reincarnation of Link. I knew you'd be here. <clears throat> this is my favorite spot to gaze out at sea when I play with the gulls. I call it Ariel's... Ariel's? I'm not sure how to pronounce that name. Look out. <laughs> oh my goodness, what is happening for us? Is something wrong? What? <laughs> Your grandma getting you to cosplay. Nintendo knows their audience well. <laughs> A PBG Zelda month. Zelda month is my favorite thing he does. <laughs> Especially uh, when he glitches uh, different games. Like this one was amazing. 
So, do you remember what day it is today? Ariel is how you pronounce words. <laughs> I'd say Errol's. I'm not sure. I'll, I'll say it both ways, I guess. I don't know. You love Zelda Month, yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> You're still half asleep, aren't you? Did you forget? Big Brother, it's your birthday. Gosh, I love this link. <laughs> That's why Grandma's been waiting for you to come back to the house. She's been waiting for a while now. It's a good thing I came to find you. You should probably go home and see what Grandma wants, don't you think? Ariel is the right way, just spelt weird. Alright, give me a second, you guys. I can't hear anything all of a sudden. I'm gonna try and fix that. Let me mute myself so I don't accidentally bump the mic. Sorry about that. I just could not hear anything all of a sudden. Don't mute yourself. <laughs> I just didn't want to bump the mic and be overly obnoxiously loud. Oh gosh, get off my screen. There we go, thank you. <laughs> Twitch won't let me see what I'm typing. What? Are, what? <laughs> Forrest, what platform are you on exactly? Gosh, I love this link. Like, just his expressions are amazing. <laughs> how's the uh, how's the audio levels, you guys? Too quiet? Too loud? Perfect, it's fine. Awesome, thank you. Just want to double, triple thousand check. Fantastic. <laughs> it's been- I, oh, oh blah, that is not an it's. I've been waiting for you, Link. <laughs> Link. Try these on. Time certainly flies. I can't believe you're already old enough to wear these clothes. Oh gosh, his face! Look at his face! <laughs> Who even uses geography anyway? <laughs> Lonk. Ship people. <laughs> That's one weird kid that rolls around everywhere. Don't don't question Lonk, alright? He's amazing. I should have just named him Lonk. Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> you got the heroes close. They look like they might be a little warm for this weather. Don't look so disappointed, dear one. Just try them on. Today is a day to celebrate. It's the day that you become the same age as the young hero spoken of, spoken in of, whoa, spoken of in all legends. I can't read today. Totally not creepy at all. <laughs> Grandma, I don't really want to change in front of you either. Can we, like, have a separate room or something? You only have to wear them for one day, so don't look so down. Be proud, child. In the olden days, this was the day... Boys were finally concerned to be men. They were taught the ways of the sword to prepare them for battle with their enemies. But we don't live in such an age any longer. Our ways are the ways of peace. Nowadays, I suppose Orca is the only one on the island who still knows anything about sword play. Hanging the family shield on the wall as decoration is another tradition that has been carried down from those days. Oh, you've never played this game? It's really good. <laughs> Dear one, I give you out of fashion clothing. <laughs> Does all of this make sense to you? Just 2D ones, right? Yes, yes. Isn't that nice, Link? They suit you perfectly, a perfect fit. Well, tonight I'm going to invite the whole town over for your birthday party, so I better get ready, shouldn't I? Your grandma's going to make your favorite suit for you tonight. I just know you're looking forward to it. Now, go get your sister Ariel. 
It's such a strange way to spell a name. But I'm supposed to be eating healthy. You could, if you've never had one, you can try it. There's no harm. Ow, that, that was painful. <laughs> Okay, so first things first. Monies. <laughs> You're gonna play the Nintendo Selects HD version? Yeah, this is exactly uh, what I'm playing. I don't know anything about Nintendo Selects, but... <laughs> what if I have no friends for the party, Grandma? <laughs> You got an orange rupee. Just one of these is worth 100 rupees. Your face is beaming. Awesome. So right off the bat, we're stupidly rich. No. <laughs> Orange? Where? <laughs> now see, if smiling was here, that'd be even funnier. Proceeds to get heart disease. Oh no. Okay, so before we do anything. Oh, Link, you look as cute as a bug in that outfit. I suppose I should congratulate you on your birthday, shouldn't I? Well, to tell the truth, I could congratulate myself too. We just finished building our little hutch and paddock today. Isn't it a delightful addition to the place? I was actually thinking of getting a pet and keeping it here. The boys would really like that, I'm sure. Boys love pets. What about girls? Girls love pets too. I wonder what kind of animal we should get. What do kids like these days? Listen, dearie, if you see any good pets around, be a lamb and just bring one here. If you do, I'll give you a little reward. Oh, but don't tell your grandma about it, will we? Oh no, smiling, you are here. <laughs> oh my goodness. Just looks for where they put their most successful games at $20. Oh, okay. Rolls into neighbor's garden. Ah, oh. Guys, we are hunting a wild piggy. <laughs> Lady, I've seen some of the bugs in this world. Random, hi, how are you doing? Alright, alright, no, no. We can do this. Mine. No! <laughs> how are you guys all doing today, whoever just came in? Pick up, pick, pick. Pick Why? Am I am I tapping B, not A? Ah I got the piggy. <laughs> Just toss a pig into a yard, it'll be fine. Lady, give me money for it. <laughs> Why, did you bring that little piglet all the way here just for me? Oh thank you, thank you so much. I've been thinking of getting a pet pig for a while now. The boys will be so happy when they get home, you sweetie. You got food, yay! <laughs> oh gosh. Okay, Link, hold out your hand. This is your reward. Don't spend it all in one place. You got a red rupee. That's 20 rupees. What a pleasant surprise. This little darling is cute as a button. You know what's- it's so cute that I wouldn't mind having even more of them. <laughs> She could give us money. Or bacon. Oh gosh. <laughs> Rip pig. Oh! Jeez. Okay, what's going on? Crystal bought home the bacon. <laughs> That's correct. You're a smart one. <laughs> it's just barely working so I'm gonna take my leave. I'm sorry, smiling. Oh, I wish it was working for you. <laughs> You, my friend, have just targeted me. That sounds really dark, man. <laughs> okay, tutorial. Of course, that's not the only trick in my bag. Not remotely. I can teach you a few more things if you'll just climb up that ladder over there and drop by my room. This doesn't sound creepy in the slightest. And I'm gonna do it anyway. <laughs> Who's ever looked at a button and said, aww? <laughs> Oh, this is- this is bad. <laughs> so soon, my my my. If you're already old enough to be wearing those clothes, I don't like where this is going. We need- Random is right, we need an adult. 
that it's going to be very important for you to gather as much wisdom as you can from now on. If you're to make your way in the world that is Link. Okay. <laughs> now, I've been studying a wealth of topics since long before you were born. I'm what you call a brain of all trades. You're a smart little fellow yourself, aren't you? I've been thinking it's time for me to pass some of my knowledge down, and maybe you're the one I should pass it down to. Everything that you see attached to the walls here is something that I've researched thoroughly, and before you ask, yes, I do know my filing system is odd. That Zelda's department gives that kid courage. <laughs> Organizational issues aside, however, it's all extremely useful information. You would do well to read it all very carefully. Reading leads to knowing, you know. Alright, the J-Plays, good luck with your project. You could play Monopoly on his head. <laughs> Oh. That wasn't me, I swear. Best animation in the entire game, by the way. <laughs> it's my favorite. I think you can play basketball with his head. <laughs> Such a racket, can't you keep quiet? You've knocked everything off my shelves, you dratted hooligan. Honestly, the hooligan I'm referring to is my younger and much less intelligent brother who lives just downstairs. You can take them off in front- oh gosh, Max. <laughs> Lock the breaker of furniture. The breaker of pots, usually. <laughs> he hates studying. All day, every day, the lout just exercises and practices with his weapons. Does he exercise his brain? No. The brain's a muscle too, I think. Anyway, the only thing he does study is the art of fighting. Right now, for instance, he's been studying fencing and whatnot. As if that's any use to anyone. He simply doesn't know to do anything besides exercise. I ask you, what's a brother to do? Okay, so these are just tutorial things. I'm not even gonna bother. I don't think there's anything up here for me. No. Oops. I didn't do that. <laughs> Oh, gosh, that wasn't me either. Don't worry about it. Anger management with old man. <laughs> oh, that reminds me of the old man at po in the uh, beginning of Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow. What are you doing? I just saw a wild, a wild pig. Ooh, see, look, that black one there. Don't you see him? Perfect. Oh, but, uh, this is perfect. My wife is just telling me how she really wanted a pet. Oh, I think we already covered your bases there, man. Still can't get along with his brother. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> you ready to grab it, Link? Now you can't just run up on it. Pigs are too alert of their surroundings for you to just jog up and capture one. Throw a Pokeball at the pig. <laughs> In the Japanese games, the old man is drunk. I've heard, I've heard. He didn't just want his coffee. Okay, tutorial. Piggy. He's just doing a Miley Cyrus impression, no worries. I got the piggy! <laughs> it's so cute! Justin, hello, how are you doing today? Use your Animal Crossing net. <laughs> and don't anyone call PETA on me. Why did you bring me another piglet? Oh, you were all worried that this little guy would get lonely hanging out inside the fence all by himself? That is the sweetest thing I've ever heard. You have Ganon in your town? What? <laughs> I'm doing quite well. Thank you so much for bringing us yet another family member. Here's a little something for you. Yeah! More monies. <laughs> okay, one more piggy. Oh, that's, that's not how you... Yes, there we go. What are you doing? Boy, Link! Hey, is it true that if you just have a little courage and run as fast as you can, that you can jump onto that rock out there? I don't know. Apparently, why couldn't you do it yourself? <laughs> yeah. You have this game on GameCube? That's where I first played this game. It's... A lot of fun, I really enjoy it. Oh gosh. 
Okay, don't look- don't- no, don't touch me. Is it the third piggy over here, or am I wrong? Oh, <gasps> piggy! <laughs> there we go, I got the piggy. Can I jump with piggy? Good, I can. <laughs> Those rocks have very peculiar shapes. <laughs> Oh, look at how cute it is. <laughs> I forget what happens if you fall into the water with one of these. I don't want to try it. <laughs> Dalmatian pig. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Don't cry. We're gonna get so much bacon. <laughs> look at how much space there is in that- what? I put one in. Oh, there you go. She realized, like, five seconds later. Look at this one. You sure do know where to find the cutest pigs on the whole great sea. Oh, Nathlings will be ever so much- what? Ever so much more lively. Oh, okay, that was a weird thing to read in this pen. It'll be like a big pig jamboree in here. Thank you so much. This is a very pretty place to live. <laughs> oh, that's right. I can't let you leave without giving you a present. Happy birthday, Link. Yes, that's like 60 rupees right there. Okay, so now let's go talk to our sister. And not talk to this kid who's trying to get his boogers all over us. Clearly. <laughs> Link? Don't you mean Lonk? I really should have named him Lonk. Or Lunk. Either or. <laughs> Ahoy, big brother! Did Grandma make that outfit for you? But wow, you look like you'd be way too hot in those clothes. <laughs> I guess they're pretty neat, though. Forrest does not agree. <laughs> Out of fashion clothes. It's long, don't mess it up again. <laughs> so anyway, Link, can you close your eyes and hold out your hand just for a second? Throws tissues behind himself. <laughs> I'm going to give you my most treasured belonging, but just for one day. Happy birthday! Oh, I love how she gets into a pose behind you. That's the cutest thing. Oh my god, your sister thinks you're hot. What do you do? Um, get her kidnapped and then don't try and save her. That's what you do. <laughs> so, well, do you like it? I'm letting you borrow this special gift just because you're my big brother. Aren't you lucky? Oh, why don't you try it out now, right now? Try looking over over at our house from here. Okay, I'm gonna set it to X. Big brother, uh, blah, blah. Okay, that's fine. No, because you won't give me your telescope for ebbs. <laughs> the postman looks kind of weird, doesn't he? Link, look up in the sky. What am I looking at? Oh. Throw his telescope into the ocean. That bird's about to get it. Right in the jaw. <laughs> the mailman was made just as God wanted him to be. <laughs> you got Skyrim again yesterday for your birthday, Max. What platform did you get it on? I'm gonna guess, like, PC or the new consoles, right? Link, this is so terrible. That girl fell into the forest. She needs help. But it's too dangerous to go in there without something you can use to defend yourself with. 
Listen, I can- look at this telescope. I could just smack somebody over the head with it. It's fine. I got this. I can- I can- I can do it. <laughs> You're back with popcorn? Oh, that sounds yummy. Matt, hello! How are you doing? How can they tell that person is a girl, right? Oh gosh. It's almost saltier than me. I, t I didn't realize you were talking about the popcorn. I'm like, the bird? <laughs> oh, Link's face when I said that was excellent. Okay, anyway. What's the matter, Link? You have an urgent look about you. Has something happened? Whatever it is, from the look on your face, I suspect it is no laughing matter. What say you, Link? Have you come for some serious instruction of the way of the sword? Yes, sir. Very good, your first lesson shall be horizontal slice. Okay. You don't have a shirt on. Here's 20 rupees for you to go buy one. <laughs> okay, I don't like this one. This is the one that always gave me issues when I was a kid. <laughs> for some reason. Okay, that doesn't sound right, sir. I don't... I don't know about this. <laughs> Guess he wasn't given a green tunic when he came of age. He just... Does he look like he could even be it? Like, people just pass over his birthday. Xbox 360, it's confusing though. I've been playing on 3DS called Project Mirai and it's the same buttons but different mapping. Oh gosh. <laughs> Keep thrusting. Gosh, it's Suki caught it. <laughs> oh gosh, I don't even know what I was supposed to do. So tell me again. <laughs> oh gosh, somebody's following. Who's following? I'm sorry. Oh, I missed it. Two seconds. That's what I get for having my thing behind. He's just staring at me. Oh, Matt! You followed! Thank you! <laughs> Sorry about that, I had my stream thingy in a different window. Now it's in the front window, so it should be fine. Okay. Oh, was it not that one? Oh, it's horizontal. Oh, or a uh, spinny move. Okay. Okay, can do. This is HD version. Yes, it is. It does. It does look very good. It uh, in my opinion. The original one on GameCube still looked pretty good, but uh, it does look admittedly better. <laughs> Is this the jump one? I was not reading your instructions. Okay, good. And yet, I sense a certain anxiousness in the sword you hold, an eagerness that goes far beyond the mere desire to be wielded on the fields of battle. I do not know what has happened. But I have faith in you. Somehow I doubt you will misuse that sword. You may have it, Link. I give it freely. Take the blade with you. Use it wisely and carefully. Do You do not want to let down the kind old man who has entrusted it to you. Since the olden days, this sword has been used to fend off evil. Its blade is infused with the desire to become strong and righteous. Misuse it? How? Oh gosh, Forrest. <laughs> Yay! So, um... What would misusing it be considered as? Like, this isn't misusing it, right? This is just fine? Why are there no rupees in these? Uh-huh. 
Nothing? Really? Nothing? <laughs> Uses it as a back scratcher. Interior design 101. <laughs> Argue this is the same frame of mind as me. <laughs> Okay, time to avoid snot nose brat again. I only have 96 outfits on Animal Crossing. Isn't that like 16 more than you said yesterday? Oh my god, Forrest. <laughs> Booger! <laughs> Okay, wait, what? Fairy fountain, okay. Can't use it yet, so I don't care. Oh, ouch. Stupid tree. Getting in my way? <laughs> I got more. Still working on it. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Uh, I don't think there's anything secret hidden in here that I'm aware of. Stupid tree, right? Tree's always getting in the long sway. Oh my god, forest, how can you accept that? Shh, forest is just a single tree. Well, actually, no, forest is a lot of trees. I can't hit a lot of trees at once, so it's fine. <laughs> All the forest abuse, I'm sorry. How dare you! <laughs> I've been terrible to forest lately, I'm sorry. I never understood the noise that those birds make. Like, it is such a strange noise. Just... yeah! Forest is spirit to all these trees. <laughs> I agree. Oh, that's not even gonna help you, girl. Sheep learn to fly. <laughs> wow, what's with that get up? Well, whatever. So where am I? Oh, that's right. That giant bird came in. Miss, Miss Terra? Tetra. I always read Terra. Oh, thank goodness, you're safe. When I saw you get dropped on the summit, I thought for sure you'd... Summit? So that bird dropped me on the top of a mountain? Well, wasn't that nice of it? Well, don't just stand there, let's go. Time to repair our debt to that bird in full. But miss, what about this boy? Don't worry about him, come on. Oh, poor Lunk. <laughs> Tetra agrees that Lunk's outfit is so 17th century. <laughs> Boy, big brother! If only this is Ocarina Long, he gets all the chicks. <laughs> Stupid kid. Get a hold of yourself. She's gone. There's nothing you can do. Yep, rip. <laughs> Shiny black hoe caught Ariel. <laughs> what? You want to come with us on our ship? Do you understand what you're asking? We're pirates, you know. Pirates? The terror of the seas? 
What do we get out of bringing some helpless little kid along with us? I'll tell you what we get. A headache. I know how you must feel with your sister having been kidnapped and all. But that doesn't really have anything to do with us now, does it? But Medley helps too in this game. Yeah, I love Medley. She's adorable. And how do you figure that? Just who do you- who are you? Where do you get off butting in on someone else's conversation? Please, all I mean to say is that if you big bad pirates hadn't come to this quiet little island, that poor girl wouldn't have been snatched away by that bird. And just what do you mean by that? Just be quiet for a moment and I'll tell you. Now, as my work entails delivering letters, I spend much of my time traveling amongst the many different islands. As a result, I hear many things. Haven't any of you heard word that young girls have been getting kidnapped lately all from all regions of the Great Sea? No matter, whether you've heard it or not, that seems to be the case. Young girls with long ears like yours have been getting kidnapped, never to be seen again. And unless my eyes fail me, the young girl who was just kidnapped from this island had also had long ears, does she not? Much like you do, Miss Fearsome Pirate. My point is that the bird mistook that poor girl for you, and that's why it grabbed her. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe it was young Link here who saved you from the monsters in the forest, wasn't it? Is this true? And while I'm at it, I may as well tell you that the bird that kidnapped both you and Link's sister has made its foul nest to the north, on the heights of the Forsaken Fortress. The Forsaken Fortress? Isn't that the place where... So, what are you gonna do? Under the circumstances, I don't think it would be unreasonable for you to give Link a little help, now would it? I don't need you to tell me that. Even if I were to consider it. Lately I've heard nothing but evil rumors about this Forsaken Fortress. You can't possibly mean to go there with nothing but a cheap little sword. That's not brave, that's stupid. I mean, come on, even a simple little island like this has to have something you could use as a shield. You know, something to protect yourself with? Anything? I'll tell you what, if you come back with something like that, we'll let you stow away on our ship. Oh, and one more thing. Once we leave, you won't be coming back here for a little while, so you better say goodbye to your family while you have the chance. Don't want you getting all weepy-eyed and homesick on me. Okay. I'm missing a lot of chat. <laughs> Ocarina Link has no personality. I agree, this Link is my favorite. Friend of Tetris has a very Animal Crossing nose. <laughs> Sacred of the Fortress? <laughs> Hashtag point of no return. Does a meat shield count? <laughs> What is it, Link? Please, tell Grandma what's troubling you. And where's Ariel? Is she still out playing with the gulls? Nope. Dun dun dun. <laughs> is this going to be a new livestream series? It is indeed. I want to try and finish this game. Link. Is this what you're looking for? Take it with you. I got the hero shield. This is blah blah blah. This is legendary shield said to have been used by the hero himself. I guess it is true. Ariel has really- Ariel has really been kidnapped, hasn't she? What kind of monster could take such a sweet young child? Link looks guilty as if he did it himself, like... <laughs> I finally get my own room. Oh gosh, that's terrible.
Now that you've mentioned the noses, though, I definitely see it a bit more. <laughs> wow, that's a decrepit old shield. Are you sure you can still use that thing? Are you gonna get splinters and cry? Well, whatever. If you're ready, then let's go. Are you ready? Yep. I bet Tetra doesn't even have a shield. <laughs> jelly pirate. She's just jelly of our mad, sick shield skills. <laughs> I only cried for five minutes. <laughs> Good luck, Link. Oh my gosh, look at that kid. Oh, it's touching the water. Ew. <laughs> Alright, so it's never safe to go swimming in this game ever again. Oh, this makes me sad. How much longer do you think this is going to go on, do you think? Do you have an estimate? Are you sure you shouldn't just quit right now? Seriously, think about it. I can tell you're going to get more sentimental from here on out. There's still time, you know. Are you sure we shouldn't just turn around and take you back to your island? Best cosplay maker is gone now. <laughs> I'm sure she'll be fine without, like, you know, her two grandkids helping her out. <laughs> oh, well, now, ahoy there, Swabby. As of today, I am your superior, Nico. Now, I promise I'll go easy on you, so do as I say, okay? Right, now first off, you have to take the test that all new pirates have to take. It's a bit of a doozy, so get ready. You like their highlighter color- or highlighter pen hair colors? <laughs> that was weird to read. You watch everything I'm about to show you real careful like so you can cram it into your no doubt mushy swabby brain. I can't go back, Chacha. I have a mission. Besides, Grandma said I not to come back until I have milk. <laughs> First off, you gotta press this switch. This is the only easy part. Okay, tutorial. Now, check it out. After the platforms rise up from the floor, you gotta jump on them. Okay, so I was able to jump to this first one myself, but that next one is too far, right? That's when you gotta do this. Okay, this is dangerous AF. Don't do it home. I just wanna point out that lantern is on fire. <laughs> so do you think you get how to do it? You have to swing from platform to platform to try and get to the entrance of that room over there. Here's the problem though, Swabby. Those platforms... <clears throat> the platforms only stay raised for a little while, so you don't... If you don't get there by the time they drop, you have to start over. It'll probably take you at least one year before you're good enough to make it all the way here. One rough year, one tough year full of bumps and bruises. Of course, if you manage to do it faster, I'll reward you. Now give it a try. This ought to be good for a chuckle or two. Okay, so I always put it down just because I don't know if the timer's been going the entire time. I used to have so much trouble with this when I was a kid, it was actually not funny. <laughs> Legitimately got stuck here. What? You did it already? 
I... I'm proud to have you as... as my underling. I wonder if it's okay to just give that to him. I don't see why not. I doubt I'll get busted. A year later. <laughs> All right, Swabby, I'll tell you what. You can have the treasure in that chest over there. It's your reward from the great and generous Nico. Hurry and take it before someone comes. Speed run strats. <laughs> you got the spoils bag. You can keep the items you get from enemies in this handy pouch. Hey Link, we've reached the Forsaken Fortress. Hurry up and get up here. Oh, hurry and get up here. Can I just... Okay, I have to pick these up individually? Okay, I want rupees. Really? Nothing interesting? To see if you still get a present? I probably did as a kid. <laughs> like, I was terrible at platforming. And timing. And apparently money management and farming, too. Like Harvest Moon games. <laughs> I thought you said items from animes. <laughs> Would it be bad just to buy Happy Home Design at Forest? I don't think you need to. Just go into um, Nook's Homes and Lottie will be there and she'll give you a tutorial. And then you can do it in New Leaf. What did I run into? There's nothing there! Hey, Link, here I am, up here. You ran to those big steps, clearly. Hi, Mike. How are you doing? How's your internet holding out? What were you doing with Nico? Wouldn't you like to know? Don't tell me you were playing some stupid game for treasure, were you? Well, whatever. There's something you need to see. Have a look over here. Over there. Over anywhere. <laughs> That's the cursed isle known as the Forsaken Fortress. It took me a while to realize I had to go to Nook's homes. It took me like a day before I actually twigged that as well. <laughs> there are all sorts of strange rumors about this place. What I do know is that not long ago, it used to be the hideout of a no good group of pirates you used to compete with. But they were just small time. Now the place looks like it's pretty dangerous. I knew it, look. Over there. By that window. Have you ever seen so many seagulls flock like that before? I'll bet you anything that's the place where they're, they've got your sister locked up. But it looks like the whole place is under really tight guard. This won't work. We bear, we'd be spotted before we got anywhere near landing there. Hmm. What do we do now? Okay, like, I think this is like my second favorite cutscene in the entire game. Here. <laughs> exactly, Mike. I've seen them do that in, like, parks. <laughs> Look, don't struggle. If you really want to get into a dangerous place like that, this is the only way to do it. Trust me. We pirates do this all the time. Don't worry about it. It'll be a pace, pace? piece of cake. <laughs> right, Itsuki? <laughs> is everyone ready? Never you fear, kid. We're pros. We're gonna launch you good. Three. Two. One. Oh gosh, his face. I'm smiling. Hopefully it does work. <laughs> I'm sorry that it wasn't working for you earlier.
Whee! <laughs> oh no, booger water. Oh gosh, we touched it. Well, rip us. <laughs> Your sword landed all the way up there? Shoot, I'm sorry, I apologize. I guess my aim was off by a little bit. The luck on your face, priceless. This is like Navi the Rock, honestly. I slipped the stone into your pocket just before we fired you over there. It's no ordinary stone either. I can see what you're doing through this stone, and obviously you can hear me through it. Okay, tutorial. Yep. Hey, but listen carefully. I need this back after you save your sister, so don't go losing it, you understand? Alright then, down to brass tacks. The courtyard is awash with searchlights, so they'll see you right away if you go charging in. Better think it through. Ah, oh, smiling, I know those feels, man. Clean yourself in bleach, booger water pollution. <laughs> Okay, so I know that we can go up here and get this done quickly, but I want to get, like, items. Because of reasons. Is this Metal Gear? Metal Gear with barrels instead of boxes, yes. <laughs> Okay. I don't remember if there's anything down this way. I do know that we're supposed to- oh. Hmm. I know that we, if we go the other way we'll probably get out faster, but... This game is a classic. You miss me able to hide in barrels. <laughs> this game is amazing. Oh gosh, Forrest. <laughs> Solid Lunk and his trusty barrels. <laughs> These things scared the crap out of me as a kid. Especially, like, I guess the string or whatever it is tied around their... their spears. It looked like guts to me as a kid. In the HD version, it doesn't really look like that, though. Did I miss an inside joke with this long thing? Um... For myself, I first heard Lonk uh, during a Mario Kart 8 stream when someone playing as Link was being really silly. And they start calling him Blanc, so I don't know where everyone else is getting it from, but... <laughs> Zelda Gear Solid Ganon Pain. <laughs> oh, I can't remember if there's anything over here worth getting. Oh, I hate those bats. No stealing hands in this game, though. I do remember that there are hands that reach up and grab you. But I think they're later on in the game. This barrel was always here, what are you talking about? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, this is the room with the thing in it that attacks you. Eh, uh, no. No, 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 no. Don't touch me. Eh. <laughs> Never got that far yet. Floor masters, ugh. Is today Sunday? I forgot. It is indeed Sunday. That was all we came over here for, really? Alright, well, let's go back the other way. It's Roldo ships and stuff. <laughs> it's pretty much this game. Gosh, the legend of Zeroldo and Danky Kang. <laughs> Whoop! I'm not here. This barrel just fell from the sky. From the ceiling. We got classes again, no problem smiling. Classes come... Come first. His lantern just went through that board.
And it's just water and out to the entrance back there. You love that pig's face. <laughs> well, you're in luck because there's two more right here. I love how they step in time with the music. It's so cute. <laughs> I'm not here. You had no idea all you had to do is go back to next home, so they didn't really make that very clear, did they? So sneaky. <laughs> And it's like I wasn't even here. Um, nothing really in here, so next room. Oh, okay, I think this is where the compass is, if I remember. Just did it by coincidence I just paid off my loan. Uh, one of my daily quests was to pay off the remainder of my loan, so I ended up paying off my entire house. Which I've been putting off doing. <laughs> what a sneaky sneak you are, I know, right? <laughs> so sneaky. Yep. Oh, I feel like we almost missed that. <laughs> Bet she could get lots of bacon out of it. <laughs> you got the golden can? Oh, awesome! Very awesome. I'm still waiting on getting my golden fishing rod and golden net and then I'll have everything. <laughs> okay, so these are the stairs that we would have come up if we had gone up the stairs at the beginning. This is the starting part of the game, Smiling. You missed just maybe an hour, if that, and I was going pretty slow, so... Oh gosh. Controller vibrating. <laughs> Listen up, Link. There's a monster running the searchlight up there. If you can slay the monster, then just maybe it'll shut down the searchlight. I read that in the wrong order, but oh well. But you're unarmed, aren't you? All you have is a shield. If I were you, I'd try to use my shield to deflect the monster's blows and see if I could make it drop its weapon. If you did that, you could pick up its weapon, blah blah blah. Yeah, Justin, I feel like those are the ones that people usually get last. Itsuki, that's all I have as well, trust me. Alright, so screw using my shield, I can just get items from over here. Ow. I dropped my thing. <laughs> I dropped it again. There we go. And I threw my thing. <laughs> Didn't realize B would throw. Who needs a sword when you can use a random club, right? Oh, what? I only got a heart for that? I want one of those butterfly thingies. Oh well. As in no golden oh or anything else, yeah. I um I got the golden can quickly, but I only got the golden shovel recently. Okay, I forget where that goes, but I know I think that's probably the dungeon map, so I want it. Got the dungeon map! Blah blah blah! <laughs> okay. So that's just the cell down there. I think this is the cell that you get put on if you get caught. Which we're not gonna get caught, so it doesn't matter. You want the golden axe to do some major work on your town? Yeah, it's very handy. Oh, I thought I missed that too. 
My timing is terrible with these things. Relying on regular axes is so yuck. And then, like, silver ones, you, you get them rarely from the item shop at the island. <laughs> and then they usually go away so quickly. Okay, and he lifted them up. I like that you can use bad guy weapons in this game. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, blah, blah, I guess just back down here. You're fine, Link. Don't worry about it. <laughs> you got a silver water- Right when you said that, Itsuki. <laughs> okay, this is the room where that guy attacked us earlier. I never remember if you're supposed to do something with this box or if it's just there. Because you don't need it to progress. Oh. I've got it, Link. In order to reach the top of the tower where your sister's being held, you'll have to find the room right below the tower. You gotta take the door to the outside and then climb up from there. You got that? Yep. You can't fight with the telescope? I wish I could. That'd be really funny, actually. Man, you're that booty, though. <laughs> Nothing's happening. Don't worry about it. Not being so hard at the torque, right? <laughs> Do a barrel roll. Okay, so let's admire that booty until he passes by. <laughs> it's even better because it's still in time with the music, even the booty jiggle. <laughs> oh, that's a beautiful sight. Anyway. Lunk likes what he sees. <laughs> Oh gosh, I thought that, as a kid, I thought that that was a spelling error. I thought it was supposed to be slide, but apparently siddle, siddle is a word. I didn't know. <laughs> You remember being bored as fuck in the sneaking sections? Yeah, yeah. I uh, I like the game after this point where you have access to the ship and you can just start sailing around. Ugh. Don't touch. <laughs> Look at his face in the corner. <laughs> 
so serious. It fills me, fills me, fills me with determination. <laughs> Stop at the hero sword you dropped. Now you're in business. Take care not to drop it again. Okay. Hey there, forest. This game was over. Oh, never mind. <laughs> talking ship was weird, but then again, we're just talking meat and life is meatless. We're all going to the void. <laughs> it's so dark. Speaking of, of, of dark. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Speaking of uh of talking ships. <laughs> Dark forest not tank. <laughs> Link. Link. Link, gosh darn it, wake up. <laughs> Pull yourself together, Link. That ship is dank. <laughs> Thank you very much for following Armin Arminda Horan. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Welcome. Well, have you come to your senses yet? You're surprisingly dull-witted. Pull yourself together, my boy. <laughs> Did I startle you? I suppose that's only natural. As wide as the world is, I am the only boat upon it who can sp oh upon it who can speak the words of men. I am the king of red lions. Do not fear. I am not your enemy. Link, I've been watching you since you went to the Forsaken Fortress to rescue your sister. Man, that's kind of creepy. <laughs> I understand how your desire to protect your sister could give you the courage to fearlessly stand up to anything. But such a bold attempt was foolhardy. I suppose you saw him, the shadow that commands that monstrous bird. His name is... Pause for dramatic effect. Ganon. <laughs> so, the guy who's in Justin's town right now is apparently controlling that bird. Confirmed. <laughs> He who obtained the power of the gods attempted to cover the land in darkness and was ultimately sealed away by the very power he hoped to command. This is like a Sephiroth ripoff scene here, I'm just saying. He's the very same Ganon, the emperor of the dark realm the ancient legends speak of. I do not know why the seal of the gods has failed, but now Ganon has returned. The world is once again being threatened by his evil magic. Tell me, Link, do you still wish to save your sister from him? And will you do anything to save her? I see. In that case, I shall guide you to go forward, advising you on what you should do and where you should go. Ganon cannot be defeated by human hands, let alone by what little strength you possess. Sephiroth music playing in your head. <laughs> 
The key to defeating Ganon is locked away in a great power that you can wield only after much toil and hardship. Do you understand? In that case, we depart. To the Great Sea. Ah, but I'm getting ahead of myself. This has actually been embarrassing for me to admit, but although I am indeed a boat that possesses the power of speech, I possess no sail. And a boat with no sail can sail no seas. I've brought you far to the east of the dark gates of the Forsaken Fortress. On this island is a town of merchants who deal in the wide, wide, blah blah blah, wide variety of goods. If you search hard enough, surely you can find one who will sell you a sail. I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. I don't want to sneeze at you guys. I'm gonna put my mouse over the pause or over the mute button just in case I do. I'm sorry to ask this of you, but without a sail, I will be useless to you. This island of merchants is home to many valuable goods. Ganondorf then took one winged angel, but replaced any Sephiroth with a song with Ganondorf. <laughs> the island of merchants is home to many valuable goods. Did I just read that? The information they provide you may come in handy during your endeavors at sea, so listen carefully to their words and heed them well. But remember, there is no time to play. Come back here immediately, as soon as your errands are done. Oh my god, smiling? That's terrible. <laughs> oh my god, guys. Piggies. <laughs> Look at how cute it is, guys. We should, like, take a selfie with it. <laughs> Except, we don't have the camera yet. Oh well, tell someone take a screenshot or something. <laughs> so I'm feeling pretty good. Why? Because I recently got myself a pet pig. Three, in fact. You are very similar to someone else we know then. I got a black splotch pig too. How often do you see one of those? Not often, chum. Was this a blind playthrough? No, I've played it through once before, maybe a year or two ago, so I kind of forget a few things, but I know generally what's happening. <laughs> I've let him ashore to graze over yonder, but the thing is, I can't stop worrying about the little guys. Well, at least he's not asking us to pick him up. Oh, I hate this guy. If you please, young boy there, please help me. Please listen to my tale of woe. Oh, uh, okay. I like how the other option is ew, no. <laughs> my sweet, sweet daughter, my only daughter, poor Maggie. She was captured by a bunch of villains and taken to the Forsaken Fortress. What on earth could those scandals want with her? Are they just roaming around looking for young maidens? Are they just evil creatures who delight in mischief? Well, crud. Having a kidnapped daughter doesn't get you a single rupee, you know. Please, please save my poor daughter. I beg of you, here I stand begging. I hope you give those scoundrels in the Forsaken Fortress a good stare. S stare? Just stare at them, guys. <laughs> They'll pay for what they've done. Oh yes, pay. Oh no, smiling. That That's fine. <laughs> okay. So, potion shop. We don't need any of those yet. We don't even have an empty bottle, so we can't buy it. Um, I'm trying to remember. My story is a strange one. I came across cursed seas from a land far away. A land where the blizzards blow violently, heading for this town called Windfall. Dear me, my ship was torn apart by vicious winds, and this island is where I washed ashore. There was one other person with me. Yes, there was. But dare I, I dare say he was immediately arrested based on his somewhat suspicious looks and thrown right into jail. Yes, just locked up somewhere on this island. Needless to say, I'm really worried about him. Would you be so kind as to help him help free him from captivity? Indeed, it would be appreciated. That sounds kind of illegal, man. I don't know about that. Hashtag ice climbers. <laughs> hey there, kiddos. Somebody talk to me. This town is our turf. The turf of the world famous killer bees. Don't mess with us. Yay! Okay.
Welcome to Miss Mary's School of Joy. I don't think I've ever seen your face around here before, my young scholar. Are you a new pupil? We need to talk. That sounds terrible. Do we have to free this guy? Probably in there for a good reason. Oh, I know he's in there for a good reason. <laughs> I know I may look a bit flashy for a teacher, but I assure you I am one. How long has it been since I opened my school here on Windfall Island? 20 years? Ever since then, I've been teaching the children of this island about true joy. But I do have a rather joyless problem. There's this delinquent gang of four young boys who never listen to a word I say. Even though I wait patiently for those boys to show up, they never come. It's as if they don't want joy in their hearts. Could you please cast their leader, that little boy named Ivan, and talk some sense into him for me? Please, young man, for me? Sure. I say let him rot, he's not vital to the story. I usually get him just because I think in the back of his cell there's the, the pictograph, I think it's called? Picto box? Which I'm pretty sure is related to a side quest. You. What are you looking at, bud? Hey, bud, what are you? What are you? What is that? What even a question is that? Some kind of country rube? Rube? I mean, look at that outfit. What a getup. There we go. I thought I was talking to the leader. Whoops. Yo, bud, you got a problem with us killer bees, huh? Do ya? Don't tell me it's that annoying hag of a teacher again, is it? You came here to give us a talking to, because Miss Mary asked you to, right? Tell us not to skip school, right, bud? Tell us not to be tardy, right, bud? You say bud too much, kid. <laughs> Forget about all that. We're the mighty and invincible gang of the four. The killer bees. Do you think we'd line listen to a chump like you? But I'll tell you what, bud. If you want to challenge us to a competition, then we'll think about maybe listening a little bit. Sure. Everyone's jelly of Link's clothing, obviously. Especially sm uh, not Smiling Forest. <laughs> Alright. Hide and seek. Got it. I think I vaguely remember. You are such a weirdo, man. <laughs> I honestly thought that kid was just gonna jump off this- oh. Hello. Well, I mean, I wasn't wrong. <laughs> but you know what, kid? We can do that, too. Hello. You got me. Alright. One. Are you joking? <laughs> That's actually kind of funny. I didn't know he was gonna be up there. No, I do- I was trying to roll, man. Let me- let me do my rolling, please. Thank you. God, I wanna punch that kid. <laughs> oh, I didn't even need to come up here. I could just roll into the base of the tree, derp. I like how the guy froze. <laughs> he was gonna come running up to me. No. Shh. Go away. Go. Go away. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Oh. You went down here. No. <sighs> Man. I'm just trying to roll. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh gosh. Why are you here? Go away. <laughs> okay. I think there was one back here, maybe? Yeah, this looks like where one would be. Stop being so sociable, Crystal. I can't help it. I'm just trying to roll and people are trying to converse with me. This island will be the first to be destroyed. <laughs> oh gosh, whoops. There we go. 
Hey there. Okay, I think that's three, so one more. No, no, no. <sighs> Sp Spatio? Hello, thank you very much for the follow. How are you doing today? Welcome to the stream. No. You is this you again? Really? Is it the same guy? I don't like you. <laughs> no. Why is roll and talk on the same button? I love this game, but why? Just trying to do my thing. Aha! Uh -huh. No! First quest fashion forward initiative? I'm so ready. We just want to roll around at the speed of sound, right? <laughs> just want to be like Sanic. It sounded like the uh, whistle from Animal Crossing. <laughs> Can't believe it, you found all four of us and you caught us all too. Talk about utter defeat. So we lost our touch, killer bees. I guess maybe it's time we chilled out. From now on, we won't cause no more trouble for anyone. Want to reward your hide-and-seeking skills? Here, take this, bud. Peace of heart, awesome. Uh, this is our favorite possession, but you've proven you're worthy. Hello there, Jay Plays. How's your project? I hope you got it all done and finished and everything. To our bud, the hide-and-seek master. Oh, and one more thing. We need you to apologize to Miss Mary for us, all right? We're counting on you, bud. You're completely done? Awesome! Hi back, I'm Apple. <laughs> Bet that stung. <laughs> you did it, didn't you? You did something to just delinquents for me, didn't you, dear? You can't fool me. I watched it all from the shadow of my door. You really are a dear. You filled me with joy. I have to reward you. So, here's a little spare change. Purple ruby, yay! Oh, one more thing. Don't tell anybody, dear. Okay, that sounds awful shady, ma'am. <laughs> Can't stop, won't stop. <laughs> hey, sounds like you apologized to teach for us. Good old Miss Mary. And speaking of, Bud, did you know it's going to be Miss Mary's birthday soon? Think You think maybe we should give her some kind of present or something? Don't be stupid, we're the killer bees. We ain't no teacher's pets. But teachers or teach loves jewelry and junk more than anything else in the world. What she's into these days, what she call them? Joy pendants? Really? Where do you find them? Are they just laying around? If we could find some, we could get them to teach as a present and she'd be all happy. Hey, now that I think about it, when I was climbing trees the other day, I saw some sparkly light you saw you saw some sparsely light on top of some tree? What? <laughs> Maybe that's one of them pendants. What do you think, boss? Okay. Is it just any tree or is it a specific tree? I'm gonna guess it's a specific tree. And that kid has no nose? I prefer no nose rather than the snotty nose kid who was chasing us earlier. Don't talk to me. Good lord, I hate him. Oh, okay. His pendants are said to flock to those who spread joy, like butterflies to nectar-filled blossoms. Looks like you found yourself a joy pendant. Solid work. Actually, I gotta admit, we hid that thing up in the tree. We thought you might find it. 
Listen up, it's gonna be Miss Mary's birthday soon, so we're thinking of giving her a present. So it was good that we finally got our hands on that thing. But we can't be going around giving presents to people, no way, that's just not fit- That just doesn't fit the biller key- Biller keys. The biller keys, you guys. <laughs> the killer bees style. It started raining here and the power went out once. Ooh. I won't stick my nose there. <laughs> Arcadis in with the puns. Come on, bud. Can't you give it to Cheech for us, can't you? It's not like we could just ask anybody to do it for us, neither. It's got to be someone reliable who can keep a secret. You're the only one we could ask, bud. Yeah, screw that shit. This is mine. No, no, no. Not talking to you again, sir. What'd you miss? Um, I forget exactly when you left, but we uh, left the Forsaken Fortress and we're on Windfall Island now. <laughs> the Biller Keys. <laughs> oh gosh. Here he is. Gosh, the noises he makes are so creepy. <laughs> See the same green clothes and the same green hat? By the look of you, I'd say, Sir, could you by chance be a fairy? Oh gosh, why are we here? <laughs> Did you feel my telepathy? That's why you saved me, isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? Do we have to save him? I really want to pick the box. <laughs> and we need the sail, so it actually is story related. <laughs> Do not worry, Tingle knows without you telling him, Sir, yes, sir. Tingle is my name. I've been looking for you and your kind for I... For I too... Oh, for I too long to be one of your fairy folks. That was not coming out right in my head. Good name for a band, Carrie. Write that down. <laughs> and yet I was mistaken for some kind of troublemaker and put into this dreadful sort of place. How disrespectful. Oh gosh. The man boobs on him though. Ugh. Please, Mr. Fairy, rescue poor Tingle from this place and take him to where you and your kind live in splendor. Oh. Oh, we have to let him out. <laughs> Can we use him as a sail? <laughs> or as a boat? I like uh, Random's idea. Let's just throw him in the ocean. Thank you. Oh, so very much. Oh, why are you moving like that? That's kind of weird, man. Here's Tingle's heartfelt gift of thanks. I don't want it. Tingle... Oh gosh, not even gonna try. Or as tissue for Noob Island's kid. <laughs> oh, why is he posing with me? Ew. As an added creep factor, his name is an innuendo for his female sex organ in my country. Okay. I remember smiling, you did say that last time, and now it's just making everything worse. We could use him as a meat shield. <laughs> Mr. Fairy, are you familiar- oh, okay, yep, no. Don't care. Tingle is returning now to his own special island. Will you come find him? I was forgetting something important. Oh, Mr. Fairy, you want to come to my island, don't you? Don't you? Don't you? Oh, why is it- Stop it. And if you'd like to give your tingle boxes that extra oomph- it, it makes it sound worse now that Smiling's mentioned that again. <laughs> All tingles crave. <laughs> you should check the back of this cell. Check it out. Oh, gosh. And the thing is, we need to find Tingle later. Okay, Meverse, don't care. Yep. Fine. Ooh, hello. I forget how much our beginning wallet can hold. Something is telling me 500, but I'm not sure. A box of female sex organs. Oh gosh, ew. Ew. 
I'm just kind of blindly going here, by the way. <laughs> I kind of have a vague idea of where I'm going, but... She's classified as... <laughs> Never look at Tingle in the same light again. Then again, that light was already dim to begin with. <laughs> Got the Picto box! Yay! I'm gonna put that on... Why? There we go. No, I don't. Stay away. <laughs> I don't think we need a map. Not from Tingle. But really, he's 35. He just wants to be around the kids. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Date unknown. At last, I've succeeded in stealing the Picto box I've desired for so long. Succeeded, yes, but sadly, due to a slight mistake on my part, I was also caught. I've been imprisoned, but I do not give in easily. I refuse to give this wonder... Wondrous box to my captors. I decided to hide it in here in the depth of my cell and then make my escape by toddling out. Yes, that is my plan. I'll show you a map and I'm only slightly less creepy than Tingle. <laughs> of course, if I ever successfully escape from this prison, I shall one day return to recover the Picto box. I'll write the controls for it. Oh, okay, yep. Just wish I could get out of here so I can start taking pictographs. Those skulls are his victims. I know, right? Because, like, how else did he get them in there? He's the only one in here, so... And he's the one who dug this tunnel. So, I'm just saying. Um, let's go this way? Question mark? Oh, yay! I have no clue where we're going. Oh, hey, I found it! <laughs> He's actually the same tingle from Majora's Mask. He survived all this time, absorbing the life of his fellow prisoners. <laughs> oh, gosh. Majora's Mask is already creepy enough without tingle. They found their way up, but it was better than with that guy. <laughs> really? You have rescued him? That is news I deem rather great. No, it's not, you terrible man. You're one stand-up individual. Indeed, you are. Now, I apologize as I have but another favor. I'm actually considering starting up a little shop here on the island, but I'm having trouble funding my venture. I have one asset to my name. I wonder if you might buy it from me, perhaps? The people on this island have no interest in venturing out into these dangerous seas, so my chance of selling it to them is rather bleak. It's as bleak as I can describe. I'd really like to ask for 200 rupees for it, but as a favor for rescuing my friend, perhaps we may strike a deal. How does 80 rupees sound? I'll buy it. Uh, thank you very much indeed. I've received precisely. Blah, blah, blah. Take that. I've always wanted an it. <laughs> Save my life and a business as well. Treasure it dearly is the finest sale in the world. Why couldn't you just say sale earlier, bro? Okay, let's get out of here. I think that's all the stuff you can actually... No, we have to go show the guy his Picto box. Just remembered. This one, right? Yes. Why, young sir? I must say, you seem to be in possession of a very fine Picto box there. 
Are you a lover of pictographs as well? There can be no villains amongst the ranks of pictobox lovers. Take your time. Look around. I implore you. There's something really weird about a tall, older, very heavily bearded man using, like, hearts and stuff like that. <laughs> Towards a child, specifically. <laughs> Make sure to use the pictoboss in Dungeon 8. <laughs> Okay, picked a box gallery, yep. <laughs> Aren't these some finely snapped pictographs? You must admire it, or admit it. But come now, you needn't be so surprised, my young sir. There's a hobby of mine to sneak up behind people when they least expect it. That is not creepy at all. It's quite amusing diversion. Think nothing of it. By the way, the pictographs you see decorating these fine walls have all been taken by none other than myself. They are my pride and joy. See, in my younger days, I was a tireless, I was tireless, sailing far and wide across the Great Sea, snapping pictographs wherever I went. Jellies. Island will eventually be able to buy. Can't remember. First island you go to. This is a ghost ship. Chests will get later. Something we go to later, and where we just were. Especially on children. Nope, not creepy at all. I like to sneak behind people and take pictures of them too. <laughs> Man, it's it's like the Pokemon Snap that we all wanted on the Wii U, except. Zelda snap. <laughs> Hello there, children. <laughs> I'll see JPW has it. <laughs> I look in your eyes, so you found yourself a sail, have you? Very well then, I shall teach you the art of sailing. Alright, yep. I know how to do this, I think. Yep. There we go. Awesome. I'm gonna open my map so I can check on where we are, but it's hard to get lost. Oh, I can't wait until we have the treasure thing to grab those with. Jade, that sounds good if that's what you want to be called. Or J JP or JPW. I'm not sure which, which you'd prefer. The drawer locks by far the passwords that I it uses an old email address. Oh, okay. Makes sense. Ooh, Beetle Shop. Ooh, that's that's twenty rupees right there. Beetle. Beetle stop. No, no, stop! <laughs> Beetle, come back! Um, I don't think we need any of those, actually. Oh, he looks so sad when you leave! <laughs> oh, we missed. Okay. This is not where we were. <laughs> Another shirtless person. Don't don't worry about it. Just don't worry about it. Don't question. <laughs> I 
Are we not all just another shirtless person? <laughs> That's one way to look at- oh. So that guy just kind of- oh, yep, okay. I hope they can swim. Bait bag? I rarely use those. I think I may have used them later on in-game, but... I can always, uh... Grab it from uh, the island we're about to go to. At least it's not a personless shirt. <laughs> Oh gosh, wasn't paying attention, was reading chat. <laughs> that explains Tingle. <laughs> that explains a few things we've seen so far. They are on the horizon. As our destination, Link, Dragon Roost Island. Oh, my favorite soundtrack. I love it. <laughs> High top this island's peak lives the spirit of the skies, a great dragon by the name of Valu. Must go see this dragon and request from him a jewel called Din's Pearl. Ask the people of Rito tribe who inhabit this island just how to see the dragon. Oh, I almost forgot. Wait just a moment. This is the Wind Waker. Like, that's just a random way to introduce the title thing of the game. Like, come on. <laughs> it is a ba baton of sorts that is used long ago when the people played music in prayer to the gods. In those days, simply using it allowed one to borrow the powers of the gods, but I do not know if it still works. Even so, I thought it might be of some use to you. Perhaps you should try using it. I was so bad at this before. I don't remember why. Tinkle is a myth over death. We know it, we avoid it, but we can never truly understand it. <laughs> Legendary toothpick. That's it, Link. That was not bad for your first time using the Wind Waker. Not bad at all. What's that? Oh, this is the me-verse thing, isn't it? I don't want to open up in case it's something really bad. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, I think this would actually be a really good place to end it, not to mention this song, though. <laughs> Anyways, I've been streaming for just about under two hours, so I think I'm good now. I hope you guys enjoyed the first I don't want to call it an episode, but an installment of uh, Wind Waker. We're going to be finishing it for sure. It isn't going to be like every stream. We're still going to be doing like other things like Stardew Valley, Mario Kart, that kind of stuff. But this is definitely something I want to get finished because I love it so much. Link looks so moist. Mike, you're saying that because you know that I hate that word. <laughs> Crystal check Discord after. No problem. Definitely will. Alrighty then, guys. What's tomorrow? I only stream on uh, Friday, Saturday, and Sundays. Unless there's something special going on, like last Monday was Halloween. But uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, as always. And uh, I hope to see you guys next Friday. <laughs> we'll see how things go. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. Oh, and thank you, Gam Gam Gammon Rage. Thank you so much for the follow. Alright, later, you guys. <laughs>